Welcome to ACS Learning. Accessibility is an important consideration for learners experiencing content digitally. In this video, we're going to review how to write a task-based job aid that we designed in Microsoft Word. Our job aid will be written to accommodate learners who have difficulties seeing and who use assistive technologies to access and interact with digital content. First, let's talk about document titles. Every document should have a unique title that describes the function or purpose. The title can be spoken by screen readers and displayed as tooltips for learners using screen magnifiers. For our job aid, we want to provide instructions for how to designate a table header, which is an important consideration for inclusive design. Since our job aid is focused on a specific task, we are going to use a title that describes the task. We will add the title in the document, as well as in the document properties. Now let's talk about headings, which help learners quickly find what they are looking for within a document. Learners can listen to a list of all headings and skip to only the headings they want to hear. For our job aid, we will have a heading for the document title and a heading that transitions the content from conceptual information to step-by-step -step instructions. Now let's talk about conceptual information. Concepts help put information into context. Concepts also help learners remember what is taught and apply information to their specific needs. If a concept is best illustrated, it is important to provide a summary either in the body copy or as alternate text so that learners who cannot see the illustration can understand the information. If bulleting is needed to avoid long, complicated sentences, consider using parallel structures. You can use the same sentence structure or the same part of speech. Parallel structure, also known as parallelism or parallel construction, means using the same grammatical form or pattern for two or more words, phrases, or clauses that have the same level of importance in a sentence. This can improve the clarity and balance of your writing. If you want to emphasize a word or passage, try using descriptive language instead of font styles, like bold, italics, or underline. Some screen readers announce font styles unless they are configured to ignore them. For our job aid, we will add a few sentences to explain why the task is important and why certain steps need to be taken. We will use two screenshots, one that illustrates options to designate a table header, and one that shows how users select a header row to repeat at the top of each page if the table ever extends to multiple pages. Plus, we will make sure each image has an alternate text description that can be read aloud for our learners who use assistive technologies. To describe table header options, we will use a two-column table structure with a designated header row. We will add a clear and concise alternate text description. And we will make sure that every cell has content. Instead of using incomplete sentences in the description column, we will write full sentences that reinforce each option we are describing. Finally, let's talk about the step-by-step -step instructions. Writing instructions for a job aid requires you to think like the learner. Each step should appear on a separate row. Tell where to go and then what to do. Instead of using directional instructions, call out specific labels in the user interface. When necessary, provide additional context that is specific to a step. And if there are more than eight steps required, consider breaking the steps into two or more parts. By taking into consideration these writing techniques, you can make strides toward creating accessible digital content. For information about how to use Word, check out the many resources Microsoft offers. You can also visit www.acslearning.com where you can schedule a free consultation to discuss your organization's learning needs and objectives. Our free learning library is where you can download an accessibility guide and watch other learning videos to help with job aid development. As your learning solutions partner, our goal is that everyone has an equal opportunity to learn and grow.